Well, we are entering day three of testimony in this hush money trial. Today, we are expecting to hear more from David Pecker, the former publisher of the National Enquirer. On Tuesday, Pecker testified that during the 2016 presidential election, he promised to be the eyes and ears of the Trump campaign. This trial is all Biden. You know, this is all Biden, just in case anybody has any question. And they're keeping me in a courtroom that's freezing, by the way, uh, in a courtroom all day long. Well, he's out campaigning. Thursday, the historic criminal trial of an American president continues. Jurors will hear more from David Pecker. During a nearly three hour direct examination by prosecutor Josh Steinglass earlier in the week, the former head of the National Enquirer spoke about his years long friendship with Mr. Trump. He also detailed how he used the tabloid's practice of catch and kill to pay for, but never publish damaging and salacious stories about Mr. Trump. All this was done during the 2016 presidential election. Pecker gave the example of a Trump Tower doorman who claimed Mr. Trump had fathered a daughter with his maid. Pecker said his investigation found the story was not true. Regardless, he reached out to Michael Cohen, Mr. Trump's former personal attorney. Cohen is one of the key witnesses for prosecutors. Pecker said, quote, I called Michael Cohen and said, we have to go forward, and negotiated a price of $30,000, and told Cohen, I believe the story is important and should be removed from the market. According to Pecker, Cohen said, boss would be very pleased. Trump is facing 34 felony counts of falsifying business records and is accused of hiding hush money payments to conceal an alleged affair with adult film actress Stormy Daniels ahead of the 2016 presidential election. He's denied the allegations. On the stand, Pecker said the doorman signed a source agreement that he would have to pay $1 million in damages if he sold the story elsewhere. Pecker told jurors that even if the story had been true, he would have held on to it until after the election, saying, quote, if it got out to another outlet, it would have been very embarrassing to the Trump campaign. So we are expecting testimony from David Pecker to continue today. This trial is expected to last up to two months. That is the latest from Midtown Manhattan. Karen Dillon, PIX11 News.